Now, I actually managed to sell that work, uh, even though somebody could easily have built it themselves. Um, uh, I managed to sell it, and uh, based on the uh, strength and success of that particular contribution, I was invited to uh, create a commission uh, to celebrate the 50th anniversary of LEGO, and uh, the, you know, the 50th anniversary of the invention of LEGO. And the only constraint was that I had to make use of the text from the actual patent. So this is a, this is a paragraph, uh, a fully quoted paragraph uh, from patent number 3,005,282 uh, by Gottfried Kirk Christensen, uh, the inventor of Lego, who says, toy elements of this kind will be referred to generally as building bricks. And the principal object of the invention is to provide improved coupling means for clamping such building bricks together in any desired relative position, thus providing for a vast variety of combinations of the bricks for making toy structures of many different kinds and shapes. Now, it just so happens uh, that coincidentally, if you take this particular paragraph and repermute, rearrange all of its letters exhaustively, you get this directly quoted paragraph from the great order of the universe by Democritus. <laughs> Atoms bombard the unplumbable void, plunging like silvery raindrops or drifting like twinkly hoarfrost, and by coalescing, if kindred, they cause things to appear, and by separating, if opposed, they cause things to vanish. And from these interknit vectors, objects interlock, forever becoming one prolific universe, distinctive for its mild infinitude of forms.